So this will be a quick tip video that's not very game breaking knowledge, but it's uh, going to clear up, you know, some misconceptions about this, the skid system because I for sure thought it worked a different way. So if we take a look through our skids, um, we can see that, you know, they got different buffs and whatnot. Healing cost, uh, soldier and defense, person, my personal favorites, um, etc. But I always thought, you know, you have to choose each individual one. So for like War Day, I would put this one because, you know, skill defense or I would put this one. And then if I'm hunting, you know, on the regular, I'm just doing healing costs. And that's how I did it, you know, for the whole time. But what I actually learned is you actually got to, if you press top right, this little eye icon and you go to buff detail. All this shit is actually permanent, so that that tells us two things, you know. First, first and foremost, like choose whatever the hell you want, cause you know if you, it doesn't matter, it's all permanent. Choose which skin you like that looks good, but it also tells us don't waste your freaking your skin fragments on like marching speed buffs, which I for sure don't, cause you know who the hell needs that shit. Sure, it might look cool, but nah, that's trash. Um, where I did mess up, though, is I could have this. So, technically, I could have, like, 0.5 more. Um, right now, I think it's 1%. It could be 1.5, so not bad. Um, and I think that's about it. Uh, let me know if this helped you at all. I don't know, by commenting, maybe liking. Uh, but, yeah, this, this helped me.